Hello, people who care to watch and listen. I have decided that I, this is all about me, that's why I keep saying I, just carry along. I'm going to start a YouTube channel for varying degrees. What you're looking at right now is random herbs. I am doo -doo -doo, dirty kitchen sink. That's actually the only I am actually making my husband some, ooh, that garlic is starting to burn. I gotta lower the temperature. A big pot of gravy, or as some of you people like to call it, sauce, Italian marinara sauce. So I put extra virgin olive oil in there, and some, oh it smells so good, some garlic, some onions, some salt and pepper, and I kind of want to saute them down. My husband has an allergy to onion. Now, by allergy, I don't know if that means he just doesn't like it or if he really is allergic to it. Not quite sure because he does have some random allergies. So, to play it on the safe side, I cook them down real good. My mom actually taught me this trick. Normally, she seasons it very well so that you can get the flavor and it locks in the flavor real tight. Oh, by the way, I forgot to take my coffee. Yeah, I had to reheat coffee out of the microwave. Did you see that farina? You know what that farina? That is deliciousness. Now, I don't know if that's poor white people deliciousness, Italian people deliciousness, but I can tell you that I've had it as a child. And now, those of you who make it with water, wh why, are you, why are you making it with water? Don't make it with water. Farina, shame on you. Don't make it with water. Make it with milk. All right, let me take this pot off the sink. That kind of got messed up. My husband is from parts of the south um i recently upon meeting my husband have learned that southern part of illinois is actually the south i mean they have the southern accents the twain i love his grandparents can't always understand them his mom his mom doesn't really have an accent his dad does a little confused on how that happened but um can't always understand them great people love them think they're great part of being family love it don't always know what they're saying. I tried to explain to them while well, here that euros are called euros and not gyros, and his grandfather's response was, well, in southern Illinois, we call them gyros. But, you know, I, I don't know. You could have to ask him. I mean, I guess after so many years of calling him something, you're not going to change it. So this is sizzling. I'm going to be adding some of this 